Thanks for watching. Today we are looking at a 2015 Honda Pilot Touring 4x4. Here inside we're looking at the steering wheel. We have control over the media mode and volume and channel as well as our hands-free calling and voice activation. We have cruise control up here as well. The steering wheel is also leather wrapped. Down here on the door we have the power windows, the locks and the mirrors with our power trunk opening right down there. Here in the center we have a very large screen that shows us exactly what's going on with some of the different functions of the vehicle. Right now we're in the audio mode so we can actually see what's going on. With our AM FM radio we also have Sirius XM and we have a CD changer with connectivity to our USB system and this guy is also a DVD player so we can play DVDs that will display on the rear DVD screen. We also have the ability here to control our iPod if it is connected through the USB jack. Also, we have our climate control here. It's really a tri-zone as there's both driver, passenger, and the rear. So we can allow rear passengers to control their own temperature or we can walk them out. Um, the large screen up above is navigated by using this click wheel down here. It's really front and center. We can move through the different menus. And it's great that it gives you um, functionality that we're very used to seeing in many of the other vehicles. So using this is very intuitive. Our automatic shifter is up here with our 4x4 lock. Large amounts of storage here and in our center console, we have our connectivity here to our power outlets and we also have our USB and auxiliary input there. Now it's a full leather interior all the way back to the third row and the leather trim continues onto the door with gray trim throughout the cabin. And up here on the ceiling, we have the power slide, power tilt sunroof. And over here we have controls for the sunroof and our garage door opener. The Pilot is sitting on 18 inch alloys with Michelin all season tires. It also has a roof rack. Back here in the rear of the vehicle, you can see the chrome tip dual exhaust. And with the press of a button, this can actually open up from your remote and inside as it is a power lift gate. Back here, there's plenty of room for storage behind the third row. The third row easily folds down into the ground as it is 60-40 split. There's extra storage under the floor here. We have floor mats still tucked away in their original plastic. We also have a power point back here for things like a power cooler and a little storage compartment. Looking at the second row here, we can see we have child seat anchor points all the way across. We also have the center cup holder armrest that does fold away to reveal that third seat. Also, we have child lockouts in the door, factory tint, and curtain airbags. Up here on the ceiling as well, we have that DVD system pushing here. We can actually remove this remote. However, it does stay up here as well to charge. And then, of course, we use that to control the DVD system. This fold-down screen is very easy to use and has great resolution. However, the DVDs are played from the front. Down here, rear passengers have control over their own temperature controls, if given permission by the front, have a power outlet, a place to plug in their headphones, as well as RCA plugs there, so that they can plug in external media, like a gaming console. To get into the third row, it's an easy latch here, you just pull up, and it comes forward and this is how you access the third row. Come on down today and see this pilot or some of the other great ones we have.